Hey, we're painting today. Um, I have my notebook. I just bought this. So I want to do a rough draft of my painting right here. Here first, you saw here first, baby. All right, so I have my colored pencils. I have my kids paint, watercolors. And then I have all of these brushes. And then I have three canvases. So if I mess up, I have another one. Um, I'm kind of a perfectionist. So, um, what am I trying to say? So I wanna do a rough draft and if I mess up, I'm just gonna try to go with it. But oh Lord, do I hate messing up. All right, so I'm gonna do an eye. I wanna do an evil eye and I want to do like a sun around it, like make the eye, so the eye is blue. I wanna make the outer, like go in with like rainbow kind of. So like we'll do like blue and then we'll do like green and then it'll turn into like a fiery sun. So I'm gonna start out with my blues. We have the light blue and we have like the indigo. Wait, there's two light blues. Which one is lighter? Yeah, I'll go with this one. Maybe I should test it out. Yeah, that's the one I wanna use. All right, and then I was just looking at like what an evil eye, like I was just like looking at the colors and looking more in depth. So it's like um, a ring of darker blue, white, lighter blue, black. And I have my black. <gasps> they didn't give me a black colored pencil. Whack. That's so whack. I guess I'll do gray. That's lame as fuck. They didn't give me black? What kind of colored pencils are these? No, I swear there's black. Oh, it's hiding. <laughs> I found it. Okay. So we have all my colors. And oh shit, I'm going for it. All right, dark blue. And I don't want to make it too big. I kind of want to make it, I guess it doesn't matter the orientation, but I'm going to, I'm going to go sideways just to start. I'm not going to make it too big. And then I'm not going to worry about how like perfect it looks or anything. Just going to do like circle, circle, circle. Again, this is just like my practice. All right, and then we got the, see, I think I made it too big, but you live and you learn. So we have the white, and then we have this blue, and then we have the black. Okay, I like it, not too bad. I'm gonna fill in the darker blue a little bit more. with colored pencils like you can't get a whole lot of color and neither can you with like watercolor either um it's coming along though yeah so and then i'm gonna make it into a sun so my bikini bathing suit cleaning day video is literally three thousand views and counting I got a few subscribers from that video and I think it's hilarious that I offer just a taste of sex appeal and then boom, it blows up. I'm not gonna become some fucking like, what is that thing when it's called like, um, when you try to grab subscribers with like the title and then you don't fulfill your promise. That's not me, baby. I'm not gonna do that. Maybe in the future, I'll probably end up doing that. All right, look at this. I like it. All right, so what comes out, like in the rainbow, I'm trying to think blue. So it goes red, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple. 
So if we're doing that, I kind of want to incorporate purple, but that just ain't it, Chief. And then I want to do, like, I want to do rainbow. I want to do, like, the green. But at the same time, there's no green in the sun. Okay, wait. Okay, there's, have you ever seen, like, the very, very sun setting when it is, like, so dark out? The sun is just going down and then it like turns green out like for a split fucking second it's like green um when the sun's going down nobody knows what i'm talking about do you um you'll have to look it up I there's like a name for it too i just forget the name do we want to make this like really really rainbow like with all the colors or should i just keep it basic no we're gonna do all the colors so here are my greens I think I'm gonna keep it light. So I'm gonna go with my three light greens. These. Um, maybe I'll start out, it flows better, I think, with the blue going from the blue, the blue on here, and then this like turquoise, and then this light. Or maybe the turquoise, dark green, light green. I'm just gonna make it wavy to begin with because the flames at the end are gonna be like intense. And I'm just freeballing it, like going for it. Wait, it would make more sense to do the dark green around the dark blue. Psych. So we're doing a little bit of the darker green. It's kind of fucked up because I did the turquoise. You know what? We can do both. That's not bad. Yeah, we can do both. I'm trying to make this like pigmented though. I mean, this is only like the copy. Okay, back to the sex appeal video, which there was like very little of. I got this comment, it was like exceedingly dull. That's what it said, exceedingly dull. I'm like bitch, um, you bitch ass. Like watch some of my content. It is exceedingly dull. <laughs> no, but I'm just out here living. It's a vlog for a reason. I don't know, I thought it was hilarious. At first I was like, mm, this bitch ass, it's my first mean comment, fuck him. And then I kind of like came to terms with it. And like, he just wanted to see a bitch in a bathing suit. <laughs> like go to the motherfucking beach probably can't he's probably like some disgusting predator that just wants to see bitches in bathing suits <laughs> all right not too bad this is why it's a rough draft and then i'm going through with like the lighter green and then we're doing another little wavy Yeah, it like flows nice. And then as I go out, I'm gonna make it less wavy and more like, more like fucking uh, sun rays. Or rather, um, you know how in drawings it's like spiked? <clears throat> the, the rays are like kind of spiked. So I'm kind of gonna go for that vibe. Um, towards the outer part. I'm no Bob Ross, but I sure am entertaining. Um, so I haven't been drinking a lot, so that's really nice. I occasionally, and by occasionally I mean like sometimes when I drink, and I wouldn't say it's often, but it's more often than it should be I think I get sad I like start getting upset over like little things and the world feels like intense there we go yeah I don't like the dark green I don't think I'm gonna go with the dark green and the actual like thing 
and I'm losing space and I'm just on green. And do like a thin line. No, I'm not. Maybe like a thin line. No, because that's blue. I'm not going to do it. We're going straight to yellow. I have a light yellow and I have like a dark yellow. And then I have some kind of varying of peach. I'm not going to do the peach. I would like to maybe do some pink in here. Okay, yellow is kind of where the flame starts, so maybe I'll do like a little bit of sun. Kind of like a little bit more spiked. I made this one actually like way too big. Ooh, this yellow is very pigmented. I really like it. Yeah, I haven't been drinking that much. And then like I say that, and then I'm like, oh, I'm doing really well. Like maybe I can allow myself like one drink. But like one drink turns into like a few drinks. And then surprise bitch, I'm sad again. And it's like, I really need to tame that shit. Somebody the other day, they were like, on one of my videos, they were like, why do you cuss so much? I'm like, I don't know, I think it's kind of hilarious. Like, I don't mean to cuss a lot, but it's funny to me. Like, the way I use <laughs> the word bitch. Like, it's just funny. And the F word, I feel like gets my point across a little bit harder. Like, cause I don't mean it seriously. I'm not like, I don't mean it like, I never say a cuss word and I'm like cussing somebody out. That's not what I do. So it's more of a thing of like, um, it's just hilarious to me. Oh yeah, also this is part one of like three parts. So I'm doing this part one. Oh, not bad. I need to find, I need to figure out how to do like the green transition into the yellow. A little bit better, a little bit cleaner. Do we dive into the orange or do we do a little pink? This yellow, I feel like it's just messing the vibe up a little bit. Yeah, I wanna do a little pink. Well, then again, we have three oranges. I'm gonna go with the light orange and then the dark orange. And then we're starting to build the flames. Yeah, that looks nice. And then the red will be really intense, I think. My friend was gonna paint with me yesterday, but, um, so I was looking at the wrong schedule. I'm like, how do I do that? And this is the second schedule I've messed up and been like called, called in and they were like, um, hey, is everything okay? Like, are you coming in today? And I just like, my heart drops straight through my ass and I just sink. And I'm like, oh no. Because I, like, it's just my schedule, it varies. So sometimes it's hard to keep track. It's really not that hard to keep track of. You look at your schedule and you go to work. But like, our schedule varies sometimes. And so it's like you expect one thing and then like, sometimes it's not always exactly that. So it's kind of frustrating. But this is the second time I messed it up, so I was looking at the wrong schedule. And I end up getting a call. It was like, so I was supposed to be in at three, I get a call at like 3.30. And I think by this point, like after accidentally missing one schedule, or one accidentally like fucking up one schedule, they I think they kind of knew, they were kind of like, 
oh, what if she did it again? Like she may have just, oops, I did it again. And they were right. I messed up. So I was gonna paint, I had a super productive morning. I like cleaned everything. I deep cleaned my apartment and it feels so good to have like such a clean place again. I feel like I have to do it once every couple weeks, you know, like sweep, mop, spray um, the bathroom down, get out my sponge. And so that's what I did yesterday. And then I was feeling really productive. So I went to Walgreens and saw, I was just like looking, you know, like I don't really get to shop because the nearest mall is kind of far away. So I just don't like get to shop. So when I'm bored, I'll just go to Walgreens and like kind of see what's up. And I found these cool paints. And I was like, I need to be a little bit more creative, I think. Creativity is so fun. So that's what I did. I bought some colors. But yeah, see, uh, my friend was gonna come over and I had to call him up. I was like, well shit, I fucked up the schedule. And he was like, no worries. But I was kind of upset. I was like, I really wanted to draw and paint. But he was like, no worries. All right, so this looks like pretty red. Yeah, there's only one more shade after this. And that's like the red. And then there's like a maroon. So I'm gonna make sure not to use the maroon because I hate that color. I don't know why, but I don't like maroon. So it's not gonna take up the full page. So I feel like I need to, oh, you know, I could fill up the rest of the page with black. Or I'm looking at my colors now. Yeah, I think I might do the rest of the black because then it'll be like space. And then I can do like some glitter. I didn't buy glitter, but maybe I'll go back to Walgreens and buy some glitter and then make stars. That would be kind of cool, I think. And then I think I'm gonna start blending a little bit more of the orange and the yellow. I need to blend the yellow to the light orange. Yeah, but this is looking really cool, I think. Oh, I, I haven't even been showing you my updates. So we have the eye, green, yellow, orange, dark orange. And it's not like super proportionate. I kind of like that about it. Actually, it's very unproportionate. I haven't colored like this since I was, I think I had like a small period of time, like in college, where I was like drawing a little bit. It's just never really been my thing, but it's so fun for me. And I need to start honoring that about myself, like doing what I think is fun. Because you know what? I like get into these little vibes when I don't have anything to do. I sit and I think, I just sit and think and think about things over and over and over and analyze every little thing about it and every situation. And it is mentally exhausting. And so I need to start filling my time with being productive not being productive, like, um, yeah, you know what, being productive, whether that means painting and drawing or doing something else, I'm about to start volunteering because I'm so sick of coming home either after work or spending time before work just analyzing everything about my life and getting nowhere. Like, what does that have to do with anything? It just makes me sad because then I start thinking about things like bad things and I naturally I have a, like a natural inclination to like have bad thoughts unfortunately 
So when I'm just stuck in my head, it's exhausting. And then I have to go spend a whole shift like dealing with people and I'm already like mentally exhausted. So filling my time, just loving myself a little bit more. So this is an update right now. When I add the actual flames, it's gonna be so pretty. I'm gonna make it really bold. Okay, so kind of like this. I feel like I want more of a flame. But I'm gonna blend it really well. This is a really pretty red. This is my brand new notebook, so I'm trying not to like get colors all over it. Then again, notebooks are meant to have personality. I really like the way this is coming along. You know what I realized kind of lately? That I've been, I'm kind of goofy. Like I have a big personality. I love that about myself. I love that I'm not afraid to have a big personality because I, I really used to be. I really used to be like afraid of being myself always wanted to be something else. I think we all go through that in our younger years. But I just always was like wanting to conform. And now I'm a lot more authentic, but like of those years, it's kind of hard to recover those years of being inauthentic. You know what, I just realized, how am, I'm not gonna, how am I gonna use the paint? Do, should I just do like an outline of all of this colors? Just an outline of the colors? And then use the paint for the rest of it? Or do like small, like very light shading. That's what I'll do. Very light shading, like a, a very light, a very light shade of the colors. But yeah, um, so I've always been a little bit goofy, kind of fun and like easygoing, but it wasn't until, okay, backstory. I know this guy named Patrick and I used to work with him and he was like, so he's, he's part of the old property, the old hotel that I used to work for here in Florida. So I worked for both hotels. I was like training at this one hotel and that's where I met Patrick. He's the, he's the guy. And he was like, um, he called our hotel to uh, see if we had availability because they were sold out. And he's, he was like, hey, Goofy. And I was like, wait, no, <laughs> I don't want to be, I don't want to be called Goofy. But if the shoe fits, I guess. I'm not going to make a big deal about it either because, damn, I just got color all over my notebook. And I did it again. I think from there I'm gonna go black and then I'm gonna add some planets. We'll start with a. Which is the orange one? Pluto, Saturn, Mars. We'll do a little red orange for Mars. No, but I like the rings of Saturn. What color is Saturn? Maybe I'll use this little turquoise that I didn't get to use. And then like a pink. We'll do like um, 
a turquoise Saturn with like a pink ring. Ooh, love that for me. A pink Saturn ring. I need to make it really pigmented so it stands out against the black. And then yeah, an actual thing I'll probably use. Do I have a black? Yeah, I do. Paint, a black paint. All right, well this video is already 25 minutes long. I'm gonna show you guys, ooh, thumbnail. Okay. Next step, painting. Painting. 